a group called uh, who have premature ovarian insufficiency or POI. Previously, you would have heard of it as premature ovarian failure. We don't like the term failure. You know, we've not failed in any way or premature menopause. Uh, and that happens to women when their periods stop under the age of 40. So that can have very devastating consequences for a lot of women who may not even have embarked on their family. I stopped my periods at the age of 38. I had already completed my family, but there are a lot of my patients and young women out there who are, you know, career minded and want to start their family and they can't, they haven't found a partner or they've deferred it and they are 38 and suddenly they're faced with this diagnosis of premature menopause or POI. And four in a hundred women actually go through this, but we often don't know the exact numbers. And there are some women in this group who never start their periods. One in 10,000 women will actually stop their periods before the age of 20 or may never even start their period. So it's, all this needs very specialist information, but lifestyle advice has to follow all the way through. And that's where I think as health professionals, we sometimes let uh, the public down, our patients down, because some we might recommend the right medications, but we may not focus on the counseling aspect. We may not talk about the lifestyle advice. So that